There are over 800,000 people living with dementia in the UK. It's hard to believe, but in England, only 40% of those people have actually been diagnosed. It's a growing problem, and numbers are set to soar dramatically over coming years. I'm Arlene Phillips, and having lost my father to Alzheimer's disease, I'm hugely committed to raising awareness and helping other families affected by dementia. Looking back, I wish I had been able to spot the warning signs in my father earlier, as I often feel I could have been better prepared for the journey that lay ahead. I'm not alone. There are thousands of families affected by dementia every year, and often it's a close member of the family who is the primary carer. Access to appropriate support and expert information is absolutely vital as you take on what is essentially a highly skilled role. My father never actually received a formal diagnosis at any stage, so I didn't even think to look for a specialist, but I wish I had. As the dementia progresses, it can become harder to cope with providing care at home and eventually you end up having to make the difficult decision of seeking more specialised round-the-clock care. A decision that is often full of feelings of guilt and I know that because I've been there. With over 300 care homes in the UK and a high proportion of residents living with dementia, Bupa have developed a very specialised approach to care that is highly focused on the individual. Their person first, dementia second approach is the bedrock of what they do. They are without doubt a leader in providing specialist dementia care to families all over the UK. Today I'm visiting Warren Lodge, one of their specialist dementia care homes, to see what dementia care is all about. Meeting Professor Graham Stokes, Director of Dementia Care at Bupa, and Leslie Tart, Dementia Care Manager of the Year, and I want to find out about their experiences of coping and dealing with dementia. I hope the discussions we have, which will cover everything from getting a dementia diagnosis to how to make the difficult decision of choosing 24-7 care, will act as a valuable information tool providing advice and support that relate to the different stages of the journey with dementia.